Gogsy here and welcome to my 400 subscriber special. We're here in Fur Park and I've got uh, Stevie Hamill and Craig Moore to join me. And in the just in the back we've got Simon Ramsden and... Uh, Who's that guy again? Eh? <laughs> good night, so good night. I've got q and uh, today so yeah, we're just going to get into it. Uh, and thanks very much for helping me to get 400 subscribers as well. So yeah, uh, we're going to start with the first question. Stevie, uh, I was three months old when you made your debut <laughs> for Motherwell. I, I, can't, I can't remember anything about it, but I hope you can. Uh, yeah, yeah, I can still remember it. Uh, it was against Aberdeen. Yes, oh, uh, Pitodri wasn't it? Pitodri, we yes. lost again. Oh dear. Um, yeah, I remember it. Uh, making me feel old. Yeah. Telling me that, but yeah, it was... It was um, oh dear. <laughs> However, was, Craig, uh, when you made your debut, uh, you scored within 12 seconds. Uh, and it was with your first touch, it makes you an instant legend. Uh, and you're up there with the likes of Crawford Baptist who scored at the same end. Take us through your goal. I just, it sat up perfectly for me, I just decided uh -huh. I would. I don't think I've hit a ball that sweet in my life. <laughs> After you hit that, it was always going one direction. Are you a fan of their music? Aye, aye, I like it, I like it, I like being on there. Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> Uh, Stevie, at long last you've surpassed more goals than your squad number. <laughs> take, take us through uh, your favourite goal. Uh, my favourite goal, um, I'd say the one I scored a couple of seasons back against Aberdeen. Oh, that, one, that one rocket. Mil, rocket. Uh, fantastic. Yards, yards, like fantastic that. result that day. Yeah. After we beat, got beat by them the week before as well, wasn't That's it? Right, yeah. Aye. Uh, Craig, you were very pro popular when you played for the Blue Brazil. Is there a physical difference between the leagues? I would prefer, I would say, in the Championship, you don't get as much time on the ball. Up uh. in the S SPFL, you get a, a lot more time on the ball. Uh. But the f physicality wise, it's just the same. Uh, okay. How does it feel to be younger than your squad number? <laughs> Aye, it's, it's alright, aye, as long as it, the squad number can keep going down, I'll be happy. <laughs> Stephen, uh, back, back to last season when Reedy scored that best worst goal ever, was that moved straight from the train ground? <laughs> no, it definitely wasn't, no. Um, I think Keith Lasley took a free kick aye. from his own half, yeah. and I've never seen him kick the ball that far <laughs> himself, so I was exactly amazed, what I I was amazed they reached the, the penalty box. But aye, that, that's good. Uh, <laughs> And Craig, where were you when that goal was scored? I was in the stand <laughs> I was <laughs> holding on to him, I was on my crutches holding on to Riles. <laughs> uh, Stevie, uh, you've recently been to Iceland. What other shops do you like going to? <laughs> <laughs> well, I just took my good friend Simon Ramsden for a nice Tory macaroni. Ah, nice. the corner. Um, that was nice, but I enjoyed, enjoyed what you done with the question again. Uh -huh. Excellent. <laughs> Craig, uh, do you have a PlayStation or an Xbox? I've got an Xbox. Oh dear, I've got a PlayStation. Uh, and Stevie, <laughs> do you know what one is? I've got an Xbox <laughs> and a PlayStation. Yeah, I know what both of them are. Yeah. yeah. I'm not as old as you're making out be. <laughs> uh, do either of you play FIFA? Yeah. Because uh, I was going to challenge you to a game one day online. I don't play FIFA. Oh, do you know? No, I don't. Oh, I'd, be pretty, I'd be pretty confident if we did play that one. Oh, good one. Yeah. <laughs> uh, do any of you do the Barclays Fantasy Football team online? Yeah, we'll just set up a league uh, starting today. Uh, I was hoping that you could uh, join my league. Right. Uh, I'll On my YouTube video, I'll put a link, link in the description and the code yep. for my league. Yeah, we'll do uh, that. That'll be good, no thank you. No problem. Uh, my uncle Mark's been on the bench for nine years now. In your opinion, what does what does he need to improve to, to get a starting slot? <laughs> Do you want to take this one? <laughs> I think he needs to come off his phone a little bit more. You know? <laughs> <laughs> um, if players down injured, then he's sitting, looking, probably looking at his fantasy team. You know, there's balls uh, down, blood pouring out of their heads, and he's <laughs> on his phone. So I think that would help if he came off his phone a little bit more. Uh, Craig, my, my first trip to uh, Fur Park ended in a 5 0 victory against Kilmarnock. What was yours? My first trip. I've been to many of them. 
favourite? What was your favourite? My favourite. My debut. <laughs> of course. Uh, and for you, Stephen, uh, what was your first trip to Fur Park? First trip to Fur Park? Oh, I was back then. Yep. And what's your what are your aspirations in football? Uh, just to be playing every week in my first team, whatever it is, just Aye. as long as I'm playing. Stevie, apart from Fur Park, what has been the most impressive stadium you've ever visited and why? Um, I was involved in the, the uh, Scotland-England game last season, I was in the squad, I was on the oh. bench, just thought I'd drop that in there, so, so I was at Wembley when it was full. Scotland England game, so that was Aye. that was impressive. So I'm not just talking to a Motherwell player; I'm talking mm. to an internationalist. Mm. Yes. So <laughs> that is quite impressive, and you've uh, you've also been capped once, haven't you, That's in true, the yeah. main team? Yes. Yes. Yep. I have done my homework. Thanks. <laughs> uh, uh, Craig, what was your most impressive stadium apart from Fir Park? Was that Central Park? Uh, I would say Cuban Krasnodar's Park actually. Ah. When when I made my uh, European League debut. Uh-huh. I like that one. Uh. And Stevie, could you tell us what you did with your uh, swapped shirt at Cuban? At Cuban? Yeah. Is that when um, yeah, I gave it to one of the young supporters after the game? Yes, yeah. uh, that, that was in the paper the next yeah, day. Yeah, that's right. Someone wrote a nice article about it. You know, he was yeah. waiting about the airport and he was, he was looking tired and he was looking like he wanted to go home, so we <laughs> gave him a strip. You know, I wanted to keep it, but the wee man took it and he looked happy about it, so, yeah. so that was nice. Very nice, yeah. Very good gesture. Thanks. Uh, and Stevie, what's the worst ground you've ever played at? The worst ground? Aye. Mm. Uh, I'm not sure. The worst ground we've ever played at. Couldn't think. The ground we played in Iceland a few weeks ago, that was ah. pretty cool. Didn't have fun memories of that, you know. So oh, I'd, say that, I'd say that. But you scored a cracking header. I did. I, so, was... in fact, I can't say that because I scored a great goal in that yeah. game, so I can't. I'll need to think about that one. <laughs> Craig. After leaving the luxurious Central Park, what's been the, the best ground that you've ever played at? Best ground I've ever played at? Again, uh, Kuban. Yeah. Uh, Stevie, is there a difference to the Motherwell support now compared to your first experience? Yeah, I think there's a lot, a lot of things changed since, since I've played. Um, we've now got the young lads who like to make a great effort. In the in the east stand, you know, they bring I'll a be lot. going there after. You going there? Yes. That's good. Um, yes. They bring a lot of a lot of noise and a lot of colour to the games, which is good. We didn't That's have good. that before. Uh, Craig, uh, what what football team do you su- do you support? Is it Motherwell or is it? It's any- actually Rangers. I. Oh dear. Nah. Why am I doing, mate? Yeah, I don't. I don't follow them as much as I used to. Minor oh. football. Minor football. <laughs> tut, tut. <laughs> uh, Stevie, uh, what was your favourite sweetie when you were growing up? Because I'm old, I'd say well, there's originals, so we'll keep going with the old route. Ah, like, uh, you know, okay. So. Uh, Craig, what's yours now? Mine is Arabus. Ah, uh, uh, personal yeah. favourite of mine as well. Aye. Now, I've, I've asked you both some questions now. Do you have any for me, or is that it? What do you think? How do you think we'll do this season? Uh, and who do you think is going to be the main players for us? I must admit, uh, I'm not as confident as I have been in the previous seasons because, right. of course, we've lost quite a few good players. Right. Uh, I think Henry Kojama, that's, that's a pivotal moment in our season for him to get back. Mm-hmm. I think I think we might do better now because we've got Kojama and that new boy in that I've never heard of yeah. before. How do you think the boy Mark O'Brien's going to do? I mean, he's going to do that. Well, I don't know. I've not done much homework on him, but... That's in there, then just be oh, oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I know I was. In case you started hammering, I was like, I better tell you that's in there. I'm, I'm very embarrassed. I've not done much homework on it no, uh, right. at all. Uh, but anyway, guys, thanks for having me along. Right, okay. uh, I must say, good luck to you uh, mm-hmm. for the rest of the season. Yeah. And hopefully, we'll get to top six. And yeah. Thanks. Thanks a lot, guys. Okay. Much appreciated. Thanks. Thank you.
I hope you enjoyed that guys. Please leave a like down below if you enjoyed it and want more Motherwell content. Subscribe if you haven't already and peace out.